Hey guys, uh, I was just taking a little walk through the woods and um, you will not believe what I just found. Uh, this creek, this part of the creek, it's a little tributary to the creek. Um, the only time it has water in it is when it rains, but there, ha there happens to uh, be a little puddle here. Let me turn the camera around and show you guys. As you can see, this puddle is really small. I mean, no water up there, no water down here, and I had seen some movement in here. So I stopped. I figured they were just crawdads, but there's actually a couple of fish in here. So the other day, they, when I seen that one, they must have been working their way back up the creek, but I'm gonna find something to get these fish out of here and get these back in the main water so they don't die. Hey guys, uh, I decided to actually grab my fishing pole. I'm gonna try to fish for these out of here. Um, I dug up some earthworms out of my garden. So uh, let's try to get these fish rescued out of this puddle and back into the main water. seam in there. He's not wanting to take it. I don't know if you guys can see the swirling around in the water. It looks like he's thinking about it now. He's inching in. Looks like there might only be one little guy in here. Dude. I'm not going to give him too much time. Might have to do this the hard way of getting down in there. He doesn't seem to want this bait. Well, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this bucket and try to scoop him out of there. Um, he's obviously not hungry. I can't get him to bite on the uh, fishing pole, so I'm just going to get down there and scoop him out real quick. There seems to be only one fish in there. I promise you guys there's a fish in here. <laughs> Let's let this water clear up a second and get back to it. As this water clears up a bit, I just walked up ahead here, and this is actually pretty cool, guys. Um, this whole system is a spring fed creek, and as you see, we got water up above, running water and it just disappears back under the ground here I get down here and show you guys better just goes right back under the bank and goes all through this back down probably another 50 feet away it pops back out but I never knew where it went underground at that's pretty cool 
Well guys, the water still ain't cleared up after about half an hour, so I uh, rigged up this little net real quick. Uh, I'm going to try to scoop around and get him out. And I think I got him, guys. I do. All right. Oh. Might be kind of hard to catch. Nope, I got him. There you guys go. It's still cold out here. A little creek chub. Get him back into the uh, main creek. Well, we made it to the bigger creek. Um, I've got some clean fresh water in here so you guys can see him swimming around there he is guys little creek chub in there so let's get him back in the water now Well guys, that's one fish saved. Uh, I really have no idea how we got up that far in this little side creek here. Um, but he should be just fine now in this main water. Thanks for watching.